we shared with you a story about the Komen Tissue Bank and its hope to collect breast tissue, tissue from women in Kenya. We have learned those plans fell through, and we want to tell you why. Continuing our series on breast cancer all this week, here's Good Morning Indiana anchor Beth Vaughn. The majority of women in Kenya who get breast cancer get a certain kind, and that's why the breast tissue samples from this population were so interesting to cancer researchers here in Indianapolis. These are pictures from a site visit early last year. Unfortunately, we've learned the Kenyan Institutional Review Board did not approve the project. And in a Komen Tissue Bank blog post, the group points to a number of cultural differences that stood in the way of advancing this effort. But they're not labeling the project as a failure. Komen learned Kenyan women are thirsty for knowledge, and they want help to stay healthy. And that's why doctors plan to use what they learned in this international exchange for other projects in the future. In fact, two trips are already in the works. The Komen Tissue Bank plans to travel to Detroit and Houston next year, targeting women of certain cultural, ethnic, and racial groups. Here locally, almost 2,400 women are on the interested donor list, and you can be too. The Komen Tissue Bank wants your healthy breast tissue to better understand how to cure breast cancer. For how to donate, log on to theindychannel.com. Beth Vaughn, RTV6.